Hello, how is everyone doing today? Welcome back to Merchant of the Skies. We are en route to Castlefield because there's a quest there to get rid of some apples. So at least we're getting that off the box. It's not going to be much gold. We get a nice ticket out of it, which is nice. The most important thing that's in Castlefield, well, it's not in Castlefield at all, is we're on the world to the Isle of Giants because we need to level up in order to construct a proper empire. We're close to adding more ships into this mix and really getting somewhere. So let's recharge while we're here and complete the quest. There we go. Essentially a free recharge and we're, we're very close to being more than a journeyman in the trade guild. Let's see what we can buy or sell here. Uh, normal price, slightly underpriced dyes. We can get some dyes and then maybe do some work with that. We can also buy some stone even though we're making some stone. That's an idea actually. Even though we're making stone and we're making rocks, we've got, we're good on money. It's only 350. It's 425. And... That's helping up the uh, the upgrades we can do back at our trade empire. So I'm going for it. I may regret that decision because we've since the start of last episode, we've gone down about four grand. We started at the nine somethings and now we're in the five somethings. So that's that's not good, but we can make money now. We do know how to make money now. Uh, I forgot what I was going to go with that. Never mind. Ignore me. Stay and listen. We, you feel more confident. So now we can build one extra building, which is what it's all been about. So we can, I think we've got enough fuel. Now we've upgraded everything. We've got enough fuel to just pop straight back up to copper tree. So what do we need in copper tree to... What we want was the uh, the trading post. Why does it stop doing... Oh, it's every time a ship goes over. I wish it didn't do that. That's one idea for like... If the developers are watching this, which is very unlikely... Fix that, because I want to be able to look at this when the ship's going over stuff as well. And then it keeps... But never mind, never mind. Once it's there, we can actually stop. There we go. So... We don't want to upgrade the forge anymore. We're already maxed out on resources as it is. We do want to upgrade the sand mining depot. And we do... We want to upgrade the storage as well, seeing as we're setting this up to be our, our key point in our caravan empire. But that's less important. Right now, it's upgrade the sand and build... The caravan office, which we can now do. Not it's not a quest. And there we go. There's the caravan office. Recharge 34 gold. Dirt cheap recharging here, which is very helpful. Need 25 more crew to operate. Ooh. Ooh. Hold on a second here. Let's send all the workers we can. What's all the workers we can? How many workers is that? Okay, that's all my workers. And there they go. There they go. So I've got to go to a house, hire loads of workers again, come back here. It's, oh shit, that's a lot of workers. And we are losing money here. Take or store goods. Uh, What do we need on the other island? It's, I'm going to take it all anyway, because we might need it in the future. We don't have any iron ore here either, but I don't think we need any more iron for the time being. So I'm not going to rush that across. No, we're good for now and we've got enough glass for now. So anything more produced there, we can sell. So let's... Uh, well, yeah, let's upgrade this here. 12 a day. We need more stone. I imagine if we get more stone, we'll get that to 15 a day. So that will be producing then at least the right levels. Where's the stone? That stone's over here. Let's quickly... Oh, we're slow as fuck. Oh, we're slow as fuck. I, sh I should have knew that when we gave up all the uh, stuff. Never mind. We'll grab, grab a bit of stone from here, and then we'll grab some people to hire. That'll do us. 15 stone. Uh, oh, we also need more of this. As wow, it's a good thing I checked. Where is the nearest house? House in Greenlock. There we go. And we'll get the winds as well, which means we'll sail there happily on one guy. There's just one guy working on our ship right now. So, house. Hire nine people. There we go. So now we're fully stocked up. Copper tree. I do wonder if it's quicker for me to deposit five people here and like go back with optimal crew and do it that way. Or send all the workers. Anyway, that's two trips. Yeah, send all the workers. I've already done it, so I don't know why I'm debating it. One more trip, and we've done it. And then we've got to go back, get more workers. 
Although we are going to get hit by a pretty big wage bill soon. So we also need to... Slightly underpriced here. 560, there we go. Let's hire nine people. We won't drop them off just yet. We'll go to Cloud Kirk first. Sell all the gems. Then back up to Copper Tree. So, demand is high. Uh, what? Oh, what? We, we paid like 112, didn't we? So, let's, let's go to 245. That seems good. 245. Uh, do we want to sell glass? Oh, sell more gems. Spices. Oh, what do we pay for spices? Let's, let's, let's sell them for 33. Uh, do we want to sell anything else? Oh, can we sell batteries? Mm, we can sell batteries. That's cool. We don't want to sell any resources just yet because we still might need them for other projects. So let's just go off that. There you go. We're making a bit of money. A bit of cash. Not a great deal, but we made a bit of something. We made a little summit summit. Keep us ticking over. 217 isn't the worst, actually. It's a lot, a lot worse than that I was expecting. For bills. So what do we want to do? Oh, yeah. Send all necessary workers there. While we're here, upgrade this for the fifth and final time. So that's producing 15 a day now, and this is taking 15 sand into six glass every day. So if you upgrade, don't upgrade this anymore because then we'll exceed production there. Uh, we do want to get some iron here going because I imagine iron's more expensive, more useful. Also, and we'll take more glass just in, just in case. So green lock one more time. What are we doing? Iron ore's looking good in Edgeshire. That's still the slowest producing of our lot at the moment, but we're not really using it for a lot of things, so not too worried. So now nine people. Cool. So we're fully stocked. Buy or sell goods. Uh, they can, can buy more gems. Let's not though. Let's not. Because I, I think we've got what we need to make money from what we've got here. So let's go back to Copper Tree. I think we've got a fully stocked crew. And at Copper Tree, we can set up our transport empire now. I'll, I'll decide to see how this works. Do we need to buy a new ship for it? Do we need to... So, no ships assigned. Buy new ships at the ship. Right, so we need to assign it a new ship. Right, okay. Which we can do which is cool but brightdale needs delivery resources to brightdale 50 lumber we have we have almost 50 lumber there so we can do that we'll get a bigger discount on ships as well and we'll buy a ship there so we'll do what we need to do for this because this is our objective it's not lose sight of our objective here we're doing okay for money we've got enough money to survive storage is full at alder scar that's not a big deal Just things are getting complex. There's a lot to manage right now. And we need 25 stone. What do we have? 18. So luckily we, we need 7. I think we've got 7. So that's stupid. That's me being stupid. I apologise wholeheartedly for that. I apologise profusely. So let's take our store goods. Take all that. And we'll take the stone as well, because you don't need a bit of stone. You never know, it might come in handy for us. One more time. I wonder what we get for finishing the lighthouse. I think this is the fourth of the fifth stage. Pay the fees. 244 we're paying every week now. That's a lot of that's a lot of moolah. Luckily we're in a position where we can make a lot of moolah too. We still have a few gems unsold. We can go back to the bazaar and sell them. Let's rebuild the lighthouse. There we go. Last one now. Uh, gems it needs, gears it needs, and dyes it needs. That's doable. That's doable. Gems we can get cheap. Gears we can make at the iron place, and dyes we can buy cheap. But we are going to... And this is the last one, I believe. Yeah, four out of five. So... It means the stone, the glass, the iron we're making 
we can sell. Which is good, a good thing. So, uh, let's refuel here. I don't want to take any risks at the moment. I'm starting to get a headache trying to balance all these books. So. Cloud, let's go Cloud Kirk. Get some money. Salad, glass, salad, iron, salad, brick. Sell everything. Let's get rid of everything except the gems and except the iron. Uh, yeah, keep the iron as well because we're going to need that to make the, the gears. And we're not going to sell the gems because we need gems as well. But all this stuff, the stone, the da da da, we're going we're gonna to sell that out, Cloud Kirk. That's a quick book. That's a quick book right there. Can we? No, not quite close enough to grab a few things on that as we pass. And just to make sure, green lock is where the slightly underpriced gems are. Edshire is making iron. We can move the iron into here. To, 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 to. Hopefully, we sell the stuff here. It's enough to get us a ship and make things a little bit easier for us once we've got that trade poster working. So, glass. How much we... 100. Oh, we're making it from sand fairly cheaply. So let's sell it at 80 a piece. Stone, uh, yeah, let's sell it at 30 piece. That seems reasonable. Uh, wood, 24, why not? I'm, I'm not really thinking too much about this anymore. Spices, 35. Apples, get rid of apples, dirt cheap, 15. I think we can probably sell apples for more than that. Yeah, 100, that'll do. I'm not too fussed. And we'll keep in the gems and we're keeping the, the iron. So let's see how that sells. I think this is the most we've ever sold in one go here. And things are selling. Things are selling. We're making money. Not the expensive items. Though. They're buying all the cheap items. The cheapo items. Which isn't great. If only we could sell a shitload of gems, we'd be happy. But never mind. We've got some stuff unsold, I imagine. Yeah, some stuff unsold. But we can we can sell that another time. We can make also make a quick buck by going to Apple Storage and selling that at Ravenbury where apples are expensive. So let's do this. Go bright hold, grab the lumber, go bright dale, unload the lumber. We get two grand straight away from that. And we get a discount on ships and we can look into buying a ship for copper tree. Ooh, there's a lot going on here. And I'm stupid. <laughs> it's, probably, it's probably more the fact that I'm stupid that's making this hard. So first things first, let's refuel to make sure we don't run out. Deliver our lumber. That's another 2,000 gold. So we're on 6,000 now. So that's a little bit okay. Uh, nah, Cog, Berlin. I like the Berlin, don't know. We, we had a Berlin before. It's 2,000. 16 storage. Good energy consumption. I like it. I think that's a perfectly acceptable trade ship for our resources to use. For 2121, one, yep. Yeah. Use new ships, sell old ship for 721 gold. Possible. Keep using old ships, send new ships to Caravan Office, that's the one. Use new ships, then old ship. Yeah, let's keep using the old ship. We, we want the best in the fleet. We want this bad boy here. And let's see what we can sell here just to help us out here. Expensive spices, very expensive wheat. We don't have any of that. And on to Castlehaven, then Ravenbury. Because we've, I reckon we can make a good fortune off. Well, we've got 200 and odd apples here. 206 apples. So if we sell them for like six a piece, that's a fortune. I don't want to work out the math on that. And I don't want to know. I don't know if we can sell them at six a piece, so it's pointless. We are selling them for. 12 a piece. But we've got to remember well, there is a cap for how much we can sell, and that's it. Oh, there you go. Still, that's good. We bought a new ship and we're almost back to exactly where we were before that, so um that's that's a good sale if you ask me. And then we go here to buy the gems we need. Five gems, I believe. Buy or sell goods. 
five gems. There we go. So that's where we are on gems. We need dyes and we need gears. So let's work into getting... Go to the copper tree. Set up our little trade empire, however this works. Oh, there's a lot going on here. I keep saying that, sorry. <laughs> I'm flustered. I'm flustered. Plot caravan routes. Okay. So we've got the Berlin. Set caravan route. Plan a caravan route so the ship performs action ordered or actions automatically. Sell ship for 40% of its price. And it's got nothing stored, but it's got plenty of storage space. So set caravan route. Cool. So if we go Edgeshire, pick up iron, go to here. Oh, we're producing 15 sand a day and we're using 15 sand a day on the forge. So we've not got any sand for this place. We need to get another sand production place to top up Alderscar. So for now, let's just set a simple one from Edgeshire, we take the iron ore, we take it to Copper Tree, and then we take it back to Edgeshire as iron, where we build a gear production. That makes sense. It's not the most efficient, but we were never going to have the forge in the same place as the, the iron production and the, the thingy production. So I think that's the best we can hope for. So go, okay, new, new action. New action. Select caravan target. Select route on the map. Okay, so go. Go here, yeah. Load cargo. Load. Oh no, we don't want to. Don't want to see it. Go. Ah ah! I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I closed it. I closed it. <laughs> okay. New action. Set caravan target. <laughs> Complex. Go to there. Load cargo. Does it, does it load iron automatically? Is that the... Load cargo at Edgeshire. New action. There. Unload all cargo. Unload all cargo at Copper Tree. And then... Oh, we can't tell it to... We can't tell it to load iron because there's no iron there. So let's just get rid of that for now and just make that. It just brings iron into copper tree. We'll handle the rest later. Maybe it's probably best to keep this as simple as possible, but we'll see. So it's literally just going from dinner, dinner, dinner. So if we look on the map now, is that will that happen? I suppose it won't tell us until we actually move, will it? Because time doesn't travel until we move. Not a problem. So what else is on the agenda? We've got to go to Copper Tree now. Oh, there, there you go. You can see it moving. Visit Isle. And this is where we're going to set up gear production. So tool workshop. Produces gears from iron ingots and bottles from glass. We've got the iron. We need lumber and we need stone. They're easy enough to get hold of. I suppose we're not producing anything here because we're full on stone here, aren't we? Yeah, we really need to up our storage here a little bit, I think. So we'll take all the stone. Uh, oven. Turn sand and stone into... Oh, we need sand here as well. That's, that's why that is. Uh, let's not upgrade it then. Don't want to upgrade that. We'll upgrade storage because that's... Usually pretty cheap. Not cheap enough for us to do it twice. Oh, God, the stress of this. The stress of managing this. It's too much. So that's empty now, and that should have iron on it for copper tree. So iron production and copper tree can continue. And we'll take... Take leave one sun there to keep things ticking over. I'm not sure how it works. We'll leave that one sun there to keep it ticking over. We'll refuel, because that's always a good idea. And we'll go back. We knew we didn't need to do that. It is the upgrade oven. We've got the stone for it. We need the wood for it. What did I come here for again? 
Oh, I came to drop off the sand. That's it. Like, so. So what I need to do is set up a sand mining thing in Northworth and then send the, sh the Berlin over to Northworth, pick up sand, drop sand at Alderscar. Oh my god, my head! It's too much! It's too much! <laughs> I'm enjoying it. If you keep saying that, it makes it true. Not enough lumber here at the moment, but that's not a problem. So I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're, we're so close. We're so close to at least finishing the lighthouse. And then once we've done that, all the benefits to our production sense will be there. We'll make a bit of money back up. We, we supply our stocks of money. Really streamline things. And uh, we'll do that in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.